What is going on Pixelings? This is Bradley here and today we're going to go over some Wii U and 3DS news. So first up is that GameStop is no longer taking pre-orders for the Nintendo Wii U and either the basic set along with the deluxe set. So no more Wii U's for pre-order. Now if you want to be like added to a waitlist, GameStop has started a waitlist for Power Up Rewards members. Be added to a waitlist so that you can be notified when additional Wii U systems become available like after the launch day of November 18th. So, won't be able to get one at launch at GameStop if you haven't already pre-ordered it. Now, along with GameStop, Best Buy has also stopped taking pre-orders for the Deluxe and the Basic set. So, two retailers are completely out. So, leave a comment in the comment section below about whether or not you were able to secure a Basic set or Deluxe set for the Wii U at either of these retailers, Best Buy or GameStop. So leave a comment in the comment section below. So moving along is that not that long ago it was confirmed that you'd be able to transfer your save data between the 3DS and Wii U versions of Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate. Like so you can take your Wii U save data, put it onto the 3DS so you can take it on the go and continue playing it. But now we have some details about how this process will work. So basically you will have to download an application on the Nintendo 3DS to be able to transfer the save data between the two systems. Now a plus for this is that you can do this through wireless means so you don't have to have an internet connection to be able to transfer the save data. You can just like be close to the Wii U I guess and just transfer the data without an internet connection. And another plus is that it doesn't take very long. Next up is that we have some of the first off-screen gameplay footage for the upcoming Wii U title, Nano Assault Neo. Now, this, might, this game might not sound similar to the game that was released on the Nintendo 3DS, Nano Assault. That game had some pretty sweet-looking visuals for a 3DS title, but now they're coming out with like a game for the Wii U. I don't know if it's a Wii U eShop title or not, but it would be nice if it is a Wii U eShop title for like, I don't know, 15 bucks or something like that. But I think you will also be able to play this like whole game on the Wii U gamepad. But don't take my word for that. But nevertheless, we have some of the first off-screen gameplay footage for this game that you can find on my blog. There'll be a link in the description below for that off-screen gameplay footage. So last up is that there is a new trailer that was shown off at the Tokyo Game Show for Ace Attorney 5. You can go find that on my blog. Link in the description below to that trailer. This game features like full 3D models of characters instead of the 2D flat art style of characters, so you go ahead and check out that trailer if you so happen to want to. Plus, on a side note, Capcom is planning on releasing Ace Attorney 5 in the West. So, if you want to play this game, they're planning on releasing it in the West, like North America and Europe. So, that's a good thing. Well, that will bring us to the end of this video, guys. If you want, you can subscribe. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. You can go to the GamingPixShow.com to get news and rumors for the 3DS and the Wii in the future, but I'll talk to you all in the next video, guys. Bye!